Clarence was my little brother. Um, he was a bubbly person. He was full of life, full of energy. He was just, just a bubbly person in general. He was just, he was just my little brother, and Clarence meant the world to me. And it's a great loss now because my brother's not here no more. I can't, you know. I miss Clarence right now, and I feel empty without my little brother. He was young and he had so much to live for. So much to offer in life. So much things to still achieve. And now Clarence is not here no more. Because someone chose to take Clarence's life. And my family and myself. And Clarence meant a lot of things to a lot of people, friends, family, like I said. He, he touched a lot of people in different ways, in good ways. He was just, that's just Clarence. He was, he was just an outgoing person. And this is a great loss to the family. We're just grieving and we shouldn't need to grieve because Clarence is supposed to be here right now. And he's not, and he's never gonna be here. He'll be in our hearts. And we'll never forget him. But we shouldn't have had to go through this because someone chose to take his life. No one has the right to take a next human being's life. I don't wish it on no one to be sat where I'm sat today and feel how the way we're feeling. Empty. No answers. And as a family, and as his friends, we just need people to talk. We just need people to come forward and say what they may know on that night when my brother was murdered. No matter how small it may be, even if you didn't see someone kill Clarence, but you was just there at that nightclub in the area just to pick up a phone and just say anything. You were smoking a cigarette, if that's the case. You was on your phone. You were just stood there. You may not realize that you may have seen something, but please, I'm just asking people just to come forward and speak because I wouldn't like anyone else to go through what we're going through right now. Clarence was an amazing dad to my son. He loved him very, very much. Like, we was a team and now I feel like the team is no longer a team without him. I just feel lost. I feel confused. I don't understand how it's happened and why it's happened. And like I said before, I've got to now put up with my son on my own. And then he's only four years old. I have to tell him, I have to give it to him every day so he can understand that his dad is never going to come back no matter what he says or no matter what anyone does he's no longer going to have a father and I just hope that someone, anyone with vital information, anything whatsoever can come forward like I said for my son that's just for my son, at least do it for my son just to give any information whatsoever because like I said he needs answers. He's going to need to know everything that's happened. Even if it's not tomorrow, next week, mm -hmm. next month, he's going to need to know. He's not going to be four for the rest of his life. Yeah. He's going to be, he's going to get older. He's going to need to know and I need answers. Clarence meant a lot to a lot of many people in different ways. He was a wonderful cousin very boisterous, full of life, ready to start a new chapter. And, you know, his son was the world and he just wanted to be there and do all the things that wasn't there for him when he was growing up. Now that has been taken away. You know, it's gonna take a lot to rebuild. 
the family right now are just appealing to the general public. Nobody expects to lose a child, a brother, son, uncle, even a daughter, mother, in such horrible circumstances. And too many things have happened where nothing has come forward, nobody's come forward and unfortunately those people have just been left on the wayside. It's time as a community, it's time as people who have empathy, who have heart, who have soul to start standing up and doing what is right. We can't keep hiding and closing the curtains and thinking this is all gonna go away because it's not gonna go away. So I'm begging, I am appealing, I am asking that you please, please come forward with any, any information. Thank you.